All right, so just finished watching this movie, Gayal. Sick movie. Um, when it first started, I was like, okay, uh, Musa, you gotta remember this is back in the nineties. This came out what nineteen ninety exactly. So I was like, gotta, I gotta remember. I gotta remember. That's when it came out. <laughs> um, so when it started and everything, I was like, okay, interesting. But then within like five minutes, I totally forgot that I was watching a a night a nineties movie. You know that once, like, cause I got so sucked in into the the movie. Um, which obviously means it was a, a great movie, it's a great watch. Um, at the end, I was like, damn, I'm glad I watched this. This was so good. Um, that that less action, there was a ton of action in this. Uh, there was actually a fair bit of romance, um, bit, a little bit of co comedy here and there. Um, but I really liked the music. <laughs> Surprisingly, I wasn't expecting this one to have that like, great music, but the music was vibey. Um, I liked the lyrics as well. They were they were fire. It was good. It was good vibes. Good vibes. Um, the villain, um, he plays. He played a good villain because every time I've seen a movie with him, he's always playing that villain. I don't know his name exactly. Um, maybe I should have put it on the screen. But the guy that plays the villain, you know who he is. If you've seen the movie or you're watching this, um, every time I see him movies, he's always playing like the evil dad, or he's just playing straight villain. He just has the eyes, the eyes for it, right? That that look. Um, he did a good job. The main character, he did a um, Ajay. Ajay did a very good job. Um, I like the way they were um, explaining the story. The way the story got explained was very good. Like in the beginning, boom, he's just arriving at jail. I'm just like, yo, okay, boom, jail. Why is he in jail? Automatic questions already started, and then he's spending time in jail. He's working out. He's doing this thing. We're like, what's going on? Why? Why is he? he's not talking to no one? He's locked in. I'm like, damn, what's he trying to do? <laughs> Is he trying to escape or something? Damn. Um, and then it goes back in time, showing us how he got to where he got to, um, which I really enjoyed. And that's where all the music and everything started coming through. And I was like, okay, this is one of those movies. I was expecting pure action as from this cover, which is the cover of the actual movie. I was expecting nothing but action throughout, but it was actually very romantic, a little love story happening, brotherly love, you know, family that type of energy in the beginning which i really enjoyed and i'm glad they added that in um and then it turned back you know what i mean the whole situation with the broski and then and then the court case and then and, and then the wife ski you know what i'm saying and then he's left by himself he's getting locked up because because he got you know set up and whatnot you know what I'm there and then a whole mess after that he was like i'm i'm on this i'm on this revenge shit. <laughs> and then he was out for blood that's what he was on. He was out f for blood. And then he just went crazy with the, with the guys in prison as well, helping him out. Because they were all sentenced to life, right? All four of them. So it was either spend all our time in jail or help this brother get some revenge. And we might survive, right? We might. And that was that was nice of them, actually, um, for them to do something like that. Um, that guy with the, with the knives, he had some sick aim, right? <laughs> That guy had a knife, had some sick aim. Um, but yeah, for a 90s movie, they did very well. Um, I can imagine this back in the 90s must have been crazy. Must have been crazy. Like, if they did this story now, with the, with the technology we have now, um, maybe they might ruin it, but I still feel like it would be a sick movie. <laughs> because the storyline was very good, you know? Um, it reminded me of certain movies that I've seen in my life, even the ending part. Um, it reminded me of those, but yeah, I definitely enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun, good man energy, good man vibes. It's a movie that you must see if you haven't seen it already. Um, if you want to watch it with me, you're more than welcome to join our Patreon, Saucy Fam, linked in the description. We have plenty of movies over there. Um, but yeah, this was one that I'm, I was very happy that I got to see in my lifetime. Um, <laughs> I've been saying that a lot lately with, with the movies that I've been given. Uh, but they're all top movies man this was easily like an 8.5 8 8.5 8, out of 10 it was it had everything man action um great storyline a, a romance was in there a little bit of comedy awesome music um great like, fight scenes um and the actors and everything actresses they all did great i really enjoyed it uh yeah man that's it for me
I shall catch you guys in the next one. Love life, love life, love life. Peace.